queens welcome back it's queen of queen she me and today i'm actually here with another beauty video and you guys this one is actually featuring sephora i actually was invited to the the holiday preview event where it was featuring all of the new new that had just recently came out you know sephora because you know sephora they always have new stuff coming out as well as other brands and yada 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 but you guys know i love sephora that is like my favorite one-stop shop especially for my skincare if you haven't subscribed make sure you hit the subscription button down below so you can be notified when i upload new content here on my channel okay but anyways back to the holiday preview event um yeah i am a vib rouge member you guys meaning that i spend too much damn money in sephora and that's why i get invited to the <laughs> to these exclusive events no but seriously you really do get a lot of sneak peek previews and you get like free goodies and special bonuses as well you guys i went we had fun and i want to share with you guys some of the new products that they are actually having this year for the holidays for 2017 so if you're interested to see what i got continue watching Let's just go ahead and just get rid of this paper because we're not going to need that. <laughs> Let me just start with the free goodie um, because pretty much if you spent so much, I think you spent like $50 or more. Yeah, y'all, I spent a little money. Um, yeah, you got this free cute Sephora bag. And look at that. It has the little lips on it. But this is the bag. This is so cute, you guys. So thank you, Sephora. And you guys know I'm going to use this because first of all, look at all those shades of pink. So you guys know I'm already, you know, in love with this. So um, yeah, no, it didn't come with any free samples but it is a good size um actual pouch so if you're like one of those beauty queens or whatever that you know like to carry your makeup with you or travel or whatever um yeah you i would like put my makeup brushes in here actually that's what i would really use this for it's like makeup brushes so this is actually handy so thank you to sephora but let's get into what i actually purchased First thing I picked up is from Dr. Jar, and you guys know I love Dr. Jar. I've actually been using them for some time now. I've actually been using Dr. Jar like for a year. Yeah, I've been using Dr. Jar for over a year. And this is their rubber mask, clear skin lover mask. And you guys know they came out with these rubber masks sets pretty much early on in 2017. And I actually have the brightening one. It's the yellow one, and I haven't used it yet, but I'm gonna actually use this one and I'm gonna film it. I want to review review it for you guys. So if you want to see the other one for brightening comment down below and i can actually review that for you guys as well and it tightens and it deep cleanses the pores and it's a single use mask and so this is what it actually looks like you guys here we go so this is what it actually looks like this is the packaging and it is an actual rubber mask on the inside and as it says here it is a one use mask so, so it's a two-part system so you would first apply the clear skin pack on all over your face and then you would simply apply the um, clear wrapping rubber mask on and then you will leave this on for about 30 to 40 minutes so that's why i actually haven't tried it because um yeah usually when it's time for me to go to bed i'm going to bed and i've already washed my face <laughs> so yeah so i'm actually excited to try this out and initially when they released these um, they ran out at my Sephora of these in particular because this was the one that I wanted to actually try out. So I haven't tried that one out because I wanted to try this one first. It's crazy, I know. But yeah, so this is the Rubber Mask Clear Skin Lover from Dr. Jart. And this was actually $12.50. Um, when it comes to mask in my skincare, that's the only thing that I honestly do feel that I will really, really, really splurge on. So yeah, skincare, I'll definitely splurge on it. And I really do feel like my skin has really benefited from splurging on it. So yeah, so if you're interested in trying these out, I will have the links to everything shown today in this video down below in the description bar. Okay, so Sephora recently came out with these new mask packs, and these are so cute. They look like they're like in those little juice bags, like for like kitties and stuff like that, you know. So these are really, really neat. So we picked up the green clay mask, the blue clay mask, and then we also picked up the red clay mask as well. So yeah, pretty much green, blue, and um, red. And each one of them has a different, um, you know, property to them you know and how you actually use them or what they are supposed to actually do for your skin so the red clay mask this one is an actual um anti-fatigue and energizing mask so you will probably want to use these you know for like when you're tired you know you haven't really had a lot of rest or if you may necessarily be you know a little under stress because you know you will get 
like bags and stuff underneath your eyes but for each of these you get four uses you guys so this is dope these were like eight dollars a piece and so i felt like these were worth it i can use them more than once i can get up to four uses out of this one pouch and with my face i'm probably sure i can probably get a little bit more the next one is the blue mask and this one is for detoxifying and oxygenating and i love masks like these because one i'm an oily girl even though i do have combination skin and i really more so have combination like right here and just just right across here on like underneath my eye right up above my cheekbone I really like to use masks where they actually detoxify my skin because I noticed that I really do have a lot of um, clogged pores. For my skincare regimen, I like to use detoxifying masks and especially like anything that has charcoal in it. So this one in particular, um, it doesn't say anything about charcoal and charcoal, but it does. This is an exfoliating mask. Now I just noticed that too. So this blue clay mask is an exfoliating mask. And it's a detoxifying and oxygenating mask. And you guys, I think that is so dope. And again, you get four uses out of each of these packages. Yeah, this one doesn't exfoliate, but the blue one is an actual exfoliating mask. So I'm going to really, really love this one because then it's going to help to remove all of those dead skin cells. So we can reveal all those nice, you know, clean pores. You can put your mask on and this stuff is just going to just really help to just detoxify the skin. So I'm really excited to try the blue clay mask. And then the green clay mask is for purifying and pore perfecting. So the blue and the green, you guys know I was definitely on a bandwagon about because I like to have minimized pores. I like to remove any excess oil, dead skin, anything like that. I like to keep my face as clean and smooth as possible. And this mask as well is an exfoliating mask. And this is the purifying and pore, per pore perfecting mask. And y'all, I mean, this is dope. So between all three of these, I feel these are really going to be very beneficial to my skincare regimen. And also too, it's good to change up what you're actually using for your skin because your skin will become accustomed to certain products. And then after a while, they're not going to work anymore. So yeah, so that was another reason why I went to the holiday preview event. I wanted to see what any new products would have came out you know especially from certain brands that i've been using now for quite some time because i will still use like the same brands but i'll just change up what is actually being used from their actual collections all right so that is pretty much everything for skincare you guys and we are now going to actually move into some beauty phase that i well not beauty phase but some new phase i think are going to you know be a part of my collection so about um i would say probably like two three weeks ago i was over on roche allocate's um instagram if you guys do not know who she is she is the um owner of allocate naturals and she was featuring some cute little goodies that she had actually got from sephora and they wanted and she, i guess she was doing a giveaway cute like with, with the little bear and everything and i was just like what kind of makeup or skincare is this from sephora like what are they releasing now and moshino has actually released um some makeup you know and they have a um actual little line you guys and so this is the moshino shopping bag eyeshadow palette and this is the last one on the fucking shelf and i almost didn't get it because i already had a lot of stuff as you guys have already seen so far you know that we had in our little cart and i was like girl i was like i don't know if i need to get this but the colors in this palette you guys this palette is for everybody it could it's for anybody with any skin tone it doesn't matter who or what and where you come from this palette is like literally for everyone so i'm gonna go ahead and open it this is so freaking cute but it has the actual um shades on the side and so those are all the shades that actually came in this palette you guys oh my god that whole shade is fucking broken I don't know what shade this is. Oh, angel wings. I mean, oh my God. Oh my gosh. I really picked it up, you guys, because I really, really, really did like the shades that are in this palette. So I'm still going to share with you guys the actual shades that are in this palette. But um, you guys just going to have to, I'm sorry, the shade is broken. It's, it's, I mean, it's completely broken. I'm, I'm like kind of upset right now. But I'm going to get this because I really, really, really want it. These are the shades, you guys, that actually came in the palette. And as you can see the other shade and whichever one that is is broken and you can see it's just dust and falling everywhere the powder is all on the fucking floor but yeah so this is the palette you guys as you can see it is very woman of color friendly i feel it's perfect for anybody 
and the shade that I was actually drawn towards was this clay shade because I do not have a shade for transition wise and that's a lot of reason why I don't really wear my makeup because I don't really have a perfect transitional shade where I can use it every day and this is the perfect transitional shade the shade that is actually broken that's the one I would have been fucking using for a lid so I'm kind of upset <laughs> I'm kind of upset but I really really do like it I like bound brown um because yeah angel wings is going to be a perfect shade for like putting on top of your um eyelids so if you can probably see that on my hands it's a very pretty pink dusty um nude shade it really really is it's it's really really pretty it's it's beautiful but i'm getting ready to head back to sephora i mean it's all in my pants it was like 18 dollars for the palette but i mean it's really cute though i mean i really liked it i was gonna be using it like this week yeah but it has the shades clay bound brown pixie dust kisses cloud crossing and angel wings and i feel like it was really perfect too um even though you know we're going into the fall winter month seasons now um this palette i do feel you guys is going to be perfect for like year-round use because look at all of those shades and if you're one of those girls who are like me i'm so used to saying natural lisa but if you're one of those girls who are like me who likes you know to keep it simple but likes you know those pretty nude colors where you can change them up play them down you know or get really drastic with like a darker shade then yeah like this palette is definitely for you so that's why i was so you know drawn towards it and really wanted it so yeah i'm going back to sephora today to take this motherfucker back because i want to actually be able to use it this is the moschino and sephora pretty much um eyeshadow bag and see look at it it's this moschino on the other side this is so cute so yeah i'm kind of heartbroken right now but we're gonna make it work because i'm telling you guys when i get done filming we're going back to sephora to take this bad boy back all right so moving on you guys already know riri released some new new recently and people were going bananas about it and i had already been in the wind about it because if you're on instagram or wherever then you pretty much are familiar with fenty so um riri released fenty beauty you guys and i actually picked up a couple of items from her release uh, now let me tell you guys i swatched the hell out of her highlighters her shimmer matte sticks her skin matte sticks um i didn't swatch the foundations because i that really wasn't going in there for that i feel like i don't really have to have a lot of foundations but the foundation sticks i find more convenient yeah and then she also had a lip gloss and that bad boy is popping like i fell in love so yeah so i picked up the fenty beauty match stick and this is the matte skin in um mocha and then i picked up the fenty beauty universal lip luminizer and this is in the shade fenty glow this is the only one that she had period she didn't have any other lippy except for this one but she had a slew of foundations she had a slew of these um matte skin sticks she had i mean she and i mean she had so many shades for every freaking body you guys like no lie this is the packaging fenty beauty you guys can see that Boop, fenty beauty and on top it says fb i don't know if you guys can see that yeah so i got the shade mocha and actually um i'm not sure if these are magnetic but i know her trio um with the concealer contour and the actual highlighter sticks are actually magnetic and i mean y'all that is so dope that is so neat and so this is the shade that i actually picked up for myself mocha and so i'm actually going to swatch it here on my inner wrist so that way you guys can really see what it is i'm talking about oh my fucking god so I have mocha right here, you guys, and this is swatched. And y'all, now that I got it actually home, this looks too fucking dark. I was primarily picking this up for using it as a um, actual foundation stick because that's what I was under the impression that this was. Still correct in contour, long wear, light as air layering. So yeah, you will necessarily have to get her foundation in order to use this if you really want to get the full effect of it. But um, knowing me, I'm just probably going to use this with another foundation or something and use it that way because we're not going to be playing that game. But yeah, um, yeah, but I do feel like this shade is a little bit too dark. Cause see in store it didn't look like that but see now that i'm sitting here at home looking up against my skin and i'm in light 
um proper lighting that is the fenty beauty matte skin stick you guys this does retail for 25 dollars you guys so next is the fenty beauty gloss balm universal lip luminizer and this motherfucker is so fucking sexy i already used mine i already used mine so this is it right here it just says Fenty Beauty and it says FB again on the top on the glass. And let's see here. And so it does have that doe foot applicator, you guys. And I want to actually swatch this for you because this is very woman of color friendly. I would definitely pair this like with a brown lippy if you just want to give it that extra extra. But y'all, I love that fucking shade. Look at that shade. That shade is so universal. It's perfect for anybody, any skin tone. It really does have like a warm brown, nude, pinky um, tone to it. It really does. And it's so beautiful. It does have a shimmer to it. It does have a shimmer to it. And I really do like it. And it is comfortable on the lips by itself. So even if you didn't want to actually use a lippy with this product you don't have to this is the ultimate this is the ultimate gloss bomb like literally like so if you didn't get anything else and you're wanting to try something from fenty beauty try her glass bomb like literally literally try her gloss bomb this thing is bad like this is badass and like i really really do like it like and i plan on wearing some today so let me just go ahead and throw some on mm. oh and it smells so freaking good you guys And it really does give your lips a nice shine it's comfortable it doesn't feel greasy on the lips or anything like that it really does have a comfortable feel and it just goes on smoothly so you can put on as much as you want like i'm real extra i might go in and put in a little bit more but i really really do like her actual fenty beauty gloss bomb like this stuff is phenomenal i love it it's in the shade fenty glow and you guys i would definitely check it out she has something for everybody um so yeah i'm probably or probably not going to take back that matte skin stick i mean i'm not really sure i don't know what i want to do with that yet but um yeah you guys so yeah so that's pretty much everything that i did purchase on the sale so now um stuff that i got for free we've got some lotus masks because miss pat was having a giveaway at her station i just love my sephora girls y'all like they really really do help out in the store like i really do love them they don't just like bye bitch like whatever like no they really help you find what you need and they really do recommend products that they really do know and try so that's where i i really really do love sephora so yeah lotus masks we haven't tried these i have tried the other lotus kind i don't know if they're like lip mask or something but we've actually used the lotus mask before but just not in the sheet mask form so thank you to miss pat for those and then with my points i got a soy face cleansing milk um sample from fresh beauty you guys you guys know i like fresh beauty i love their rose mask it makes my skin so soft and it really does help with texture so yeah so i got a sample size of this this is a 20 milliliter um container so yeah you guys fresh beauty and i love sephora so i did get these with my um points this was a hundred points, so you can't beat that. And I mean, it's a facial cleanser. Come on, you guys. And then the cashier, she put in some Algenis samples. This is the Power Advanced Wrinkle Fighter 360 Eye Serum. So if you're dealing with bags or anything like that, and I might need to actually use this for my own um, eyes, you guys. So yeah, um, thanks to her. And then I also got the Genius Ultimate Anti-Aging Vitamin C Plus Serum. So yeah, vitamin C, I'm all down for that because vitamin C is good for those who have oil oily skin and if you're trying to combat that oily skin to keep your face from producing so much oil vitamin c will definitely help with that it will also help with brightening of the skin and getting rid of all of those dark spots that you might have on your face so yeah um vitamin c is very very good you guys but yeah but you can just get vitamin c also by eating oranges <laughs> and last but not least i got a tory birch um, perfume sample and this is the bill azure um fragrance and i did spray this in the car that day and it smells so freaking good perfect for these fall transitioning period you guys so tory birch the bill azure 
um perfume you guys it really does smell good though it has a light soft scent but yet it does catches your attention when you miss this so yeah i really do like that i don't like strong fragrances i just like those ones where it just kind of catches your attention reels you in and then you go on about your day <laughs> So yeah, you guys, I really hope that you enjoyed my Sephora holiday preview event um, mini haul, I guess you should say. Um, some of these things, I think the Sephora collection with the new clay masks have already been out for a while, but I know it did just come out recently. It wasn't something that was previewed during the summertime. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, Queens. Again, I will be having a review of the actual Moschino palette, and I might just actually do that on its own. And then I'm also going to do a review of the Fenty Beauty, you guys, but you actually just saw me review the Gloss Bomb here. And this is in the shade Fenty Glow, and I really, really do like it. It is so cute, you guys. So thank you so much for hanging out with me today queens please make sure that you subscribe so that way you can be notified when i upload new content here you guys this week because i don't want you to miss out because i have some more reviews coming you guys this way thank you for all of you guys who have also prayed and even reached out to me during hurricane irma we are doing fine we are safe we're actually up here in the panhandle part of florida um my family primarily actually lives down in central florida and up the east coast of the united states so thank you guys so much for your prayers your concerns you know just all your positive and your love and your light you guys i just thank you so much for just all your love and just positive energy because that's what i'm really here for and i'm glad you guys are just really just you know just really picking up on the vibes so thank you so much queens for all of your continual love and support and i'll see you guys in my next upload queens bye